What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix the there is not enough memory error you are getting while using Photoshop CC or when trying to save your project. This should be quite an easy tutorial, everything you need will be listed in the description below. First, open up your task manager. Here in the processes tab, make sure to sort the processes by their memory usage and close the applications from running which you don't need. But make sure to only add processes, which you know won't break your operating system. This could be your browser, Steam, Skype or any other application. When this is done, make sure that your operating system and graphics driver is up to date. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application if you're using an NVIDIA GPU. But you can also use the AMD driver suit. In the drivers tab, simply click on download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. When this is done, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates system settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. As a last resort, search for REG Edit in your taskbar search and hit Enter to open up your Registry Editor. From here, navigate to HKEY Current User, Software, Adobe, Photoshop and select this folder, which in my case is named 150, but the value can vary for you. Here, right click some empty space and select to create a new DWORD 32-bit value and name it Override Physical Memory MB. Capitalization is also important in order for this step to work. Double click the new D word and on this window, make sure that the base is set to decimal and set the value to how much RAM you can reserve for Photoshop to use. In my case, 32 GB of RAM, where almost all of it is available to use. That's why I will set this value to 16000, which is about 16 GB or half of my random access memory, which Photoshop will be allowed to utilize. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.